Have you ever wanted to have an element horizontally and vertically centered in responsive site designer? This is what I mean here. As we have a text as a responsive site designer and a button element here, and almost uh, vertically and horizontally centered. To achieve this with responsive site designer, I'm going to demonstrate how to achieve that. Okay. So I'm starting with the new blank project. Let me adjust this second row here. I'm going to give a height, minimum height of 550. I'm going to give a background color, something like this. All right, so now I'm going to add a container into the this column and I'm going to add my heading. I'm adding heading, let's say three. All right, and a button element into the container. Please take note that I'm adding these two elements into the container, not to, to not to in the column itself. I'm adding into the container. So let me edit the text here. And color give white color here. All right. Now for the column itself, as you know here, I'm selecting the column. In the design panel, I'm going to give a display um, sorry, display as a table. Okay. We give a column display. Table. Now for the container itself, we have selected the container and as you see the container selected. In design panel, I'm to going I'm going to give a display to table cell. Alright? Then from the vertical align, I'm going to select middle, vertical align middle. Alright? Now, text align center, and in the container itself, while selected, we have typography here, and I center the button here. This is how we vertically and horizontally center elements in the responsive site designer.